Welcome to Grade 6 Mathematics. Our topic for today is surface area of solid figures. So what do you mean by surface area? The surface area of a solid figure is the sum of all the areas of all the shapes that cover the surface of the object. For example, we have here a cube. So this is the net of a cube and it has six faces so to get the surface area of a cube first we have to know the area of the square the formula for the area of a square is s squared so that is the side or s so surface area of the cube is equal to 6 s squared why 6 because it has 6 faces whereas is the length of one side this is the net of a rectangular prism the surface area of a rectangular prism you must find the area of the four lateral face and the two bases so surface area of a rectangular prism is equal to 2LW plus 2LH plus 2WH where L is the length W is the width and H is the height this is the net of a square pyramid it has four triangles and a square base to find the area of a square pyramid surface area is equal to BH divided by 2 you multiply it by 4 because it has 4 triangles plus the area of the base which is the square so s squared the surface area is equal to 2 b h plus s square where b is the base h is the height and s is the side of the base then we have the net of a cylinder so it has two circles and a rectangle so to find the area of a cylinder surface area is equal to pi r squared multiply by 2 that is the formula of the two circle plus 2 pi r h that is the formula of the rectangular figure where pi is equal to 3.14 r is the radius of the circle and h is the height of the cylinder this is the net of a cone so to find the surface area of a cone surface area is equal to pi r s plus pi r squared where pi is constant at 3.14 R is the radius of the circle and S is the slant height this is the net of a sphere surface area is equal to 4 pi r squared where pi is equal to 3.14 
and r is the radius of the sphere so this is the unit of measures used for measuring the surface area of solid or space figures given the side we have the area if the side is in millimeter the area is square millimeter or millimeter square if the side is in centimeter the area is square centimeter or centimeter square. If the side is decimeter, the area is square decimeter or decimeter square. If the given side is in meter, the area will be square meter or meter square. If it is in kilometer, the area will be square kilometer or kilometer square. If the given is in inches, the area will be square inch or inch square. If the given side is in feet, the area will be square feet or feet squared.